Sleigh bells ringing, diamonds blingin', carols singin', favorite season Sleigh bells ringing, diamonds blingin', carols singin', favorite season They said say nigga, but you gotta be in that bag, yeah Hard working every day, I'm stressed out 24-7, babe, no, no timeouts Wish we could fly away, you and I Go to our favorite place, oh yeah, yeah Make special memories together I'll be your company now and forever I say we fly away, you and me Go to our favorite place Feeling the sun on my face in a while One of my gifts for myself for Black Friday was um, my Pioneer Woman cutlery set. So I'm super excited about this. I already have one of her butcher cleavers or her meat cutter or her meat, her meat cleavers. I already have one of those, but I have an all red one. It doesn't have the pretty flowers, but I love all of the little decorations. And I also have her cutting board. I need to get another big one like that one that I have, but this one comes with the small one. And it also comes with these little cutting mats. Y'all, I'm so excited about this. Okay, I got my kitchen scissors. I got all, all my cutting knives, which y'all know I have a thing for knives anyway. So yes, I can't wait to use these on my cooking channel. I also got myself the Pioneer Woman um, pan, pots and pans set for Black, on Black Friday. I think this was like $69 and I believe the knife set was like 30 bucks. It wasn't a lot at all. It comes with a lot of stuff. No wonder why it's heavy. It comes with a stock pot. It was such a good deal, y'all. Like, oh my gosh. It comes with a stock pot, the saucepan with the lid, um, two of those, a big one and a small one, two frying pans. It comes with a pre-seasoned cast iron skillet. What is a pre-seasoned skillet? How do you have a pre-seasoned skillet? I thought you're supposed to season your own skillet. I don't even know how that works. But um, then it comes with two like Tupperware containers, four measuring bowls, four measuring spoons, two decorative like um, tools like it comes with like a spoon and a spatula and it comes with two wooden um tools the spoon and like the spatula wooden ones like oh my gosh this was a really good deal i'm so excited like y'all don't even know i'm about to go in on my cooking channel like oh my goodness so y'all can't talk about my pots and pans anymore because <laughs> i finally splurged on myself like I will always buy for the kids first and I will always like put me last. So I never have, like I don't always have what I need when I need it, I always wait and I'll make sure they're taken care of first. So when I saw these going on sale for Black Friday, I said, honey, baby girl, you're coming home to mommy, okay? I have some more stuff coming, but these ones came 
today and I'm super excited about it really quickly. Did you guys know that Walmart will use DoorDash to drop off your gifts now? Like, or drop off your orders, like from walmart.com, not your pickup and delivery orders. Like, I ordered this stuff for Black Friday and they told me that they found it at my store that was near my house. So instead of shipping it from the warehouse, they had it delivered via DoorDash from the store. Like, they just went and picked it up and dropped it off at my door just now. That's why it wasn't in any packaging or anything. Huh. Interesting. Walmart's coming up in the world. All right, y'all. Back to business. Gotta clean up and get the house prepared so we can get ready for the holidays. chips mmm yummy you and bro 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 you eating some chips too yeah mmm <laughs> all right y'all so now that I have the boys over here kind of hanging out eating a little bit of a snack I have lunch ordered on the way to the house i kind of had a taste for like some chili it's really cold today it's like 44 degrees here in houston um kind of a chili type day so we're just gonna kind of stay inside not really do anything i really want to decorate the trees and stuff when they get home we have one downstairs and one upstairs at the top of the stairs and i can't do that right now because there's like stuff everywhere and i just need a clear mind i'm really just gonna kind of straighten up i mean it's not that bad but i need to vacuum i need to pick up the toys and the shoes from everywhere and my laundry. My laundry just like always stays over here. I asked you guys in the last vlog to give me some of your good like tips and tricks how to get my laundry under control. And you guys all gave me a lot of good tips and tricks. One of them being this. Somebody wrote me and said that I should just give everybody a basket and then instead of like trying to fold everything, just put it in their basket and then let them put up their own clothes. Stuff that's clean that needs to go get separated. Kind of did it a little different and I did like the girl, the people who share a room together. So like the twins, um, Junebug and Blaze and Cash. And then I have my, some of my stuff over here. So I'm gonna separate some laundry. I'm going to vacuum. I'm going to like straighten up. I'm gonna put the groceries up that we just got from Walmart, clean off the table and all that good stuff. The lunch is here, hold on. Face in Hawaii. food is here so it's lunch time for the boys so i'm gonna feed them eat real quick then i'm gonna get back to cleaning count your nuggets one two three nope start over how many nuggets do you have here blaze count one come on one two three four now your turn one, two, three, four. good job yay give me five okay all right you need some Barbecue sauce here. Oh, yeah. Last video, they also had chicken nuggets and fries, but it's okay because that was actually a while ago and they don't eat chicken nuggets and fries every day. They did the last time and they doing it again today. It's a quick, easy go-to lunch. I don't know what else to tell y'all, but it is. Don't judge me. Don't you judge me. Hard working every day, I'm stressed out 24-7, babe, no, no timeouts Wish we could fly away, you and I Go to our favorite place, oh yeah, yeah Make special memories, together I'll be your company, now and forever Facing a with you, with you, 
Okay. Good. Good. Where are the rest of them? They're coming? Yeah. Good girls. Come on in. Just snack coming. Snack. Snack. Put your stuff in the basket, please. Okay, go wash your hands with soap and water. Boy, when I work, go Look at your hands. When I work, oh. I fell. You fell? You okay? When I always come outside, my nose is running. Oh, wow. You, just, you got it. It's cold. Hey, Kaya. It's the boys. What's up, boys? How, girls? how was your day? Well, After you do your homework and eat your snack. I had a little, little, little whatever with somebody on Instagram who tried to say why I don't let Cadence dress like a teenager, like the teenager that she is. First of all, I'm sorry. Er, hold on. Are you a teenager? No. I'm how 12. old are you? I'm 12. Okay. So you dress like a what? A 12-year-old. I just wanted to make sure we're all on the same page. You guys, how old is Cadence? 12. Oh, okay. I just wanted to make sure, just in case we were, there was confusion. So <laughs> she's not going to dress like anything else other than a what? A 12-year-old. A 12-year-old. This person just, I don't know who they are. I tried to say this in the nicest way possible, but honestly, you know, you guys don't even see the kids enough to even assess what they dress like on a day-to-day -day basis because I don't put them on here that often. But um, Cadence picks her own hairstyles. When I say, hey, I'm doing hair, it's hair day. What would you like? And then she has a 90% say of what she gets. I try to usually give her what she asks for unless it's like something ridiculous um, mm -hmm. that I can't achieve or whatever. Um, and then as far as clothing and everything, as far as clothing and everything, she picks 95% of what she wears. Um, she already knows what she can and cannot wear. And she doesn't usually, usually even pick you know, things that she can't wear because number one, she already knows she cannot wear that. And number two, she's like kind of into other things. You know what I'm saying? I'm into like, like stuff like this, oversized stuff. Yeah. I like that. And yeah, that's actually my hoodie. She keeps taking my stuff. <laughs> I keep saying like, listen, dude, you have your own clothes, but no, she keeps taking my thing. I like oversized stuff because like it's oversized for me. Her shirts are oversized. Going, going. Not too oversized, but like oversized. And yeah. I'm white to So this is what Cadence is wearing today. Uh, uh, jeans and this shirt from Shane. Yeah, it's a cute little like, First of all, color block, which I'm into, and apparently Cadence is into also. Um, and then it's like one side is a little bit longer, and one side is like a little bit shorter, but not too short to where it's inappropriate. It's yeah, just like, it's like waist, it's, waist short. Yeah. This one's a little bit past the waist. And she's got on some cute little rips, ripped jeans, and they're below the knee, which is appropriate for school. So, you know what I'm saying? Still fashionable. Do a little, do a little spin for them, darling. Okay, still fashionable. But still what? Age appropriate for a 12 year old. I don't know if I said that right. But yet, still age appropriate for a 12 year old. All right? What's wrong with some of you parents out here? Got your girls looking like hoochie mamas. Okay? All right? No, no. You've had plenty of life to dress like a hoochie mama. But at this point in life, you dress like your age, darling. Um, but anyway, y'all, hit a like, hit a like for your girl, because it's what? It's free, and it don't cost you nothing. And I will see you guys next vlog. I need a summer breeze, some fresh air to put my mind at ease.